welcome and welcome back. I am excited that you're here. I'm Amber. Um, today we're going to talk about one of my favorite baby proofing items. Let me tell you a story. When my firstborn, Max, who will be three next month, was just toddling around, let's say maybe a, a year or so, he found an obsession with the oven. And he would pull on it, pull on it, and I would always say, don't touch the oven, don't touch the oven. And when it was on, he, was he wasn't allowed in the room because he would always pull on it, pull on it. <clears throat> but one day, I turn around, and he has pulled the oven door down, and he is in the oven, crawling in the oven. And I thought, okay, this is dangerous. We've gone too far. So I searched for an oven lock, got myself on Google. I did YouTube video searches, looked for the best oven lock. I didn't really come up with much. So I bought a couple and we just did a little trial and error. Um, the one that I'm going to talk to you about today is the safety first oven door lock. And this is the one that has been our lifesaver, literally my son's lifesaver. Um, it comes in two colors. It comes in a stainless steel type color, the one that's here, and then a white color. Um, we have the stainless steel, and then this is a stainless steel as well. Uh, there's two reasons why I wanted to do a review on, well, three reasons why I wanted to do a review on this oven lock. One, it, it, it is my favorite baby proofing item. We are baby proofed as far as like cupboard locks and toilet locks because my boys look, want to get into everything. But the oven lock is my favorite because I feel like it literally is saving lives and I didn't realize how obsessed these the little boys would be um, about the oven handle. I didn't, I didn't realize. Um, second reason that I wanted to do a review on this is because um, it works. We haven't had one problem with it. And the third reason is because when we got it, we couldn't figure out how to use it. And I literally took it out of the package and thought that I must have broken it and there's no way that this works because, and I couldn't figure, I searched YouTube trying to figure out how to use it and I couldn't figure it out. So I wanted to do a review and a tutorial on how to use this. So for anybody searching who was like me, who couldn't figure it out, and clearly doesn't know how to read instructions, I will show you how to use this. So let's just pull it out. I'll show you. Um, it comes just flat like this. And it's adhered by a 3M strip. And it just goes right on the oven. It's easy peasy to put it on. But when I got it out of the package, the first thing I did was I clicked it like this. And I clicked it locked and then I for the life of me could not figure out I didn't know what to do next and it has this arrow on it and I kept pushing this thinking it should move and it wouldn't and I thought I must have broken it until and we my husband and I literally played with this for an entire night thinking well I guess we can't use it because we can't figure out how to use it clearly very baby proof and um the way you re so this is locked and this is where it would sit in your oven and to release the lock you just push the in so it has an arrow over you push the in I was just trying to push this black thing but you push the entire thing over and see it gives you a little give here push the entire thing over and it unlocks easy so I'm going to show you how it's adhered on our stove just so that you can see what it looks like there and um, I'll show you how to how we open and close our stove and just know this is this is my favorite baby proofing item it's it blends into my stove you'll see and um, I, like I'll say it literally has saved Max's life so let's take a look so this is the new oven lock and then this is the one that's already attached to my oven obviously I'll just show you quickly um, where it attaches. So if I open up this oven here, you want to make sure that everything is cleaned properly before you attach it and that it's completely dry. And then I would just remove this 3M strip here and I would attach it right here where my oven opens. 
and then once it has dried and it ha I would give it 24 hours for it to just set um, then you can go ahead and heat the oven. So Here's the face of the oven here. You can definitely see that there's a child lock on it. That doesn't scream, I'm child locked. It's not um, very bright. So I appreciate the, that it blends in. I'll show you. I'll just put my entire weight into it here. And then if I, try, if I pull on it, it doesn't open, which is perfect. And then if I want to open it, again, I just push this flat. I push it over and up, lift it up, open it up. And then to shut it, I just need to make sure that this flap is all the way up or it's going to get stuck in this um, halfway open position. So I just make sure that this flap is lifted and then shut it. So when I shut it, I'll just show you really quick. I just always lift this flap and then just give a little push shut and then shut the flap. So safety first, the safety first oven lock. Um, this is my favorite baby proofing item. You can find it on Amazon or at um, online from the company itself. I haven't actually seen it at the big box stores, um, but easy enough to order online. My favorite baby proofing item. Um, thank you for watching. You can see my review, my full review on my blog. Um, there's a link below and then also a link to my Instagram and to Safety First as well. Thanks for watching. Bye.